This is malcontent, and this is my story. I was just a typical fourth grader. So that year, my teacher decided she was going to show everybody her family tree for Halloween. Her dark family secret. It seems that she's related to the Jersey Devil. The only problem was, down at the bottom of her family tree, was my family. Yep. According to her, I was related to the Jersey Devil. This didn't bother me at first, because for that day, only for that day, I was the coolest kid in school. couldn't wait to get home to tell my dad. I was so sure he would be excited about the news. When I walked in though, I interrupted him eating his ham sandwich. The man loved his ham sandwiches. When I told him about it, he just looked at me and said, your teacher's full of it. We were really good friends growing up. Yeah, we're cousins. But we're not related to any Jersey Devil. She's full of it. Then he continued with his ham sandwich. I actually ripped my heart out. I was laying on the floor. These days, I enjoy taking my little buddy out, Brody, and going hiking in the woods. Growing up in southern New Jersey, you couldn't help but hear stories of the Jersey Devil. After all, he is New Jersey's official state demon. No other state has an official state demon. When you're in the woods hiking, it's not hard to imagine you're being watched in New Jersey. You don't know where he's at. Jersey Devil could be anywhere. It's not enough for being alone out in the woods, even if you're with your dog, but have to navigate 
dilapidated structures and an eerie feeling that something just in the woods is watching me. Just out of sight. Sometimes you find strange artifacts, <laughs> like women's panties, ripped at a tanging on a limb. And it makes you wonder, how did they get there? Then there's those moments when you swear you heard something. Something strange. And you can't pinpoint what it was. You decide that maybe it's best just to keep moving. As your hike nears its end, you still can't shake the feeling that you're being watched. The whole time you're in the woods, it seems like somebody's had their eye on you, or something. You might think to yourself, ah, he's just silly. Out in the woods getting scared. But then you don't know the second incident that happened. It's not as simple as the first one. Not the family tree, but an actual incident.